Today marked the first day of school for many school districts in our area. More than 11,000 students are headed back to the classroom in the Hazleton Area School District. Our Lisa Sugart sat down last week with Superintendent Brian Uplinger for an important update on the new school year. Well, it's the start of a brand new school year, so we thought it would be best to bring in the superintendent of schools from the Hazelton Area School District, Mr. Brian Uplinger, to give us the latest information for parents and students. Congratulations on the start of a new school year. I understand communication is at the top of the list because your old form of messenger uh, text messaging system is no longer. So you want to tell everybody about what happened and where it's going with that. Right, great. Uh, and thank you for having me. I very much appreciate it and, and it's my pleasure to be here with you. Um, yes, uh, we utilized Remind 101. However, they, they changed their policy that for every 5,000 subscribers, we would pay $30,000. So um, having a, a district the size of ours and knowing that we had at least 10,000 uh, subscribers on the Remind, we opted to not purchase that because we'd look at about 60,000 uh, and not move in that direction. So we're looking for a, another way to provide information to more than just our families. Um, to businesses and, and to other people outside of the community that that did subscribe to that service so we're, we're constantly looking for something new so right now to communicate with parents there is a way that they can still sign up that's correct we have something called school messenger it's actually sky alert and it's within the um the skyward system in our database it's housed on our our website so parents that um need to make sure that their, their phone numbers are updated and their email addresses are updated uh, until we can find that other app uh, to utilize. But uh, the, we do have that, that system within our capabilities to send out messages. All right, so if there is any important news, you will send them an automated message and you will also send them an email. Yes, correct. And we'll also, we'll continue to use Facebook and Twitter and, and uh, things like that. So yeah, uh, that is, is really important to have parents update emails and, and phone numbers. And I know a new school year, but the numbers have increased student-wise in the district. So where do we stand right now with student population? We are a, a, a solid 11,600 students across the district. Um, the, as you said, the enrollment is increasing daily. Um, we just had new enrollments today, uh, around 20, 25 when I, was, when I was leaving the district to come here, the, the office to come here. Um, and again, that's okay. We'll take all the students that come to us. We just want to make sure that they're doing it legally. They have all their proofs, proofs and uh, are living in the, the right area for the school that they're, they're going into. And lastly, uh, what I wanted to ask you about is there is still construction going on in some of the schools, still some major construction in Heights Terrace Elementary. So students are still attending that school, all the students that were supposed to. Yes, that's correct. Uh, Heights Terrace is still a little bit behind schedule. We are, um, the construction companies are moving forward quickly. Uh, we probably won't get into the new spaces until somewhere around Christmas, um, again, which is okay. We have the accommodations made in, within the building uh, to service all the students coming to us. So we will be opening on time. And how do we look with busing? Busing looks fa uh, fantastic. We're, there are no issues. There might be a little bit of tweaking here and there with, with routing. Other than that, we're, we're golden. All righty. Well, we wanted to get you some fresh information for the start of the new school year, and we'll be talking with the superintendent from time to time to keep you up to date on what is happening in the Hazleton Area School District.